What's up YouTube? It's Matty J Mania. Uh, I'm going to do my first video game pickup video. Um, I'll get right to it. I've um, got some retro games, of course, from some local stores. Um, first game I got was Super Buster Brothers. This game is awful. Um, I recommend it to no one except for my enemies. You should play it. People have enemies with. Um, I got it for five bucks. I have two copies of it. Uh, it's pretty rare. It's an uncommon game for sure for Super Nintendo. Um, for as uncommon as it, as it is, the value on it certainly does not reflect that because the game is awful. Um, but I have two copies of it, so it's always good to have an extra copy for trade, that kind of thing. Um, got a Baseball Stars 2 with the manual. Um, I actually picked this up. I showed you. I got a complete Baseball Stars the other day. Um, so this was my extra copy. Um, so now I have two copies. Again, uncommon game. Good to have two copies. Um, got another copy of Ninja Turtles 3. Uh, these are all, like, basically all these games here I got to trade. Uh, Ninja Turtles 3 is a good, you know, beat em up. And then I got a uh, complete Zelda Phantom Hourglass. Um, I have this. I actually have every North American Zelda game. Um, didn't really like this game too much. I like it better than Spirit Tracks, though. Didn't like riding around on a train all that much all day long. But I didn't make the game. Um, here is a stack of Nintendo games that I got today. Uh, I got these from my favorite retro game store. Um, go there all the time. Uh, get some good deals. On these Nintendo games, I didn't get the best deal. Um, but what, I, what else I got there kind of made up for it. And I didn't have these games, so no big deal. Um, and I like the guy, so I like supporting him, giving him my money. Um, first one I got is Athena. I know nothing about this game. The only thing I do know is that it's J Japan's top arcade hit. I know that because the game told me so right here. Know nothing about it. Um, I got another game called Trog. Got to clean it up a little over here. But, um, I don't know, I don't know anything about this game, um, cover art kind of looks like Joe and Mac-ish, and I know that's a good game, so I went with it, um, we'll find out. I got a game, Muscle, Muscle from the Muscle Men, and Do, Do used to own it, so thanks Do, uh, I appreciate you not wanting your game anymore, I wonder if that's... Someone's initials, or maybe a little kid tried to spell Drew and put do. Um, then I got uh, Mick Kids, MC Kids, the McDonald's game, Mick Kids. Um, I mean, those kids look like they're having the best time ever. Um, I've seen reviews on this game. I've never played it. Um, looks okay. Um, I hear it's kind of like a Mario 3, very generic knockoff. Um, that kind of thing, but we'll see. Um, and thanks to Danny McCullough for providing me with McKids all these years later. So if you know Danny, tell him he can't have his game back. And now, uh, Karnov. I got Karnov. Um, I've played this game. This is the only game of those I've ever actually played. I played this game a lot when I was a kid. Um, about like fat guys shooting fireballs out of their mouths but it really looks like it's coming out of their belly button if I remember correctly I just remember having a lot of fun with it um, hopefully it still holds up or it will crush all my childhood memories one of the two will happen so we'll see um, then I got moving on to the more the more good stuff because that's English um, I got a complete Jurassic Park um, complete in the box. Five bucks. Can't beat it. Didn't get it from me. Got it from someone on Nintendo. Got it for someone on Nintendo Age. Um, Kevbot, who is hoarding all of the Jurassic Parks. Don't really know why. Don't really care. He's super funny about it. He values games in terms of Jurassic Park carts. Like you'd probably say my Panic Restaurant is worth 60 Jurassic Park carts. Something like that. Um, so I got this for you. If you watch this, Kev, it's yours. Just trade me something for it. Um, then I got um, F-Zero in the box. 
Um, surprisingly enough, with all the nin Super Nintendo games that I have, I don't have F-Zero, and I don't have it in the box. Um, it's kind of one of those games that I get so often and see so often, um, <clears throat> and I'll usually just trade them or uh, sell them with, like, Nintendo, Super Nintendo lots. Um, but this one was in the box, and the box was in nice condition. It's 15 bucks. Um, I know that's, like, retail for it. Didn't really care. Whatever. I'm happy to have it, finally. Now that I have it in the box complete, I won't be letting it go. Um, then, the better games. I got a complete R-Type 3. Really excited about this. This game is not common, um, especially in the box. has a manual, all that fun stuff. I used to have this game in the box without the manual. Traded it in part of a trade for my Earthbound box, so I'm happy to have it back. Um, at the time, I was more than happy to trade it because I wanted that Earthbound box more than anything. So, like I said, it's back home now. Pretty pumped. And last but not least, this is probably the most rare and the best deal I got, is SWAT Cats. Um, it is just the box and the game. It is no manual, but still, I got the box and... box is a little beat up. Um, I got the box and the game for only 25 bucks. Can't beat that. This game's really rare, really hard to find. Um, it is not as, say, common as, like, a McDonald's, but not as rare as, like, Jesus on a Grilled Cheese. So somewhere in between those two is SWAT Cats. Um, that's all my pickups for this week so far. I think it's a pretty good start to a week. Haven't had the weekend yet with, like, the yard sales and flea markets, that kind of stuff. So um, if you like the video give me a thumbs up. Um, if you don't like the video, I don't know. Um, feel free to leave comments in the box below. Um, subscribe to my channel. Hopefully I'll be coming out with more and more videos as I go. Um, I'm really just trying to get the feel for this video YouTube thing. Um, hopefully I'm doing an okay job. Um, yeah, and thanks for watching. I appreciate all the support, and you have a great day, evening, night, afternoon, Whenever you're watching this, Christmas, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, I don't know. Thank you.